Jojo Madara back here today with Wrath. I still can't believe we're still doing this. I know! It's almost like a never-ending nightmare. Uh, that's that's a good game. Don't, don't, don't compare that game to this. Oh, God, never-ending nightmares is such a fucking good-ass game. <sighs> like, you don't even fucking know, girl. If you haven't played it, it's it's for the uh, PS4, right? It's ingenious the way its art style is done. I know, but uh, what what systems is it? I I know it's I know it's, it's on available. The PC, for all I know. I know I know that I know that. Unreal Engine. Fuck my life. The engine that simply won't go the fuck away. The engine that makes me hate living. And now the Cry. Unreal. Cry. The edginess takes itself way too fucking seriously. Everybody, <laughs> someone. <we, laughs> I think we need to. I, I think we need to get someone with a ladle in here. Oh fuck, man! <laughs> oh, I wish I had a ladle. All right, so uh, I think I could kick Dante Dino's ass with a ladle if he was a character <laughs> in Dark Souls. <laughs> Uh, All right, so we're going back to where we've last left off with this piece of shit ass game. You know, I want I want to see if I could be like the angry, like the parody of that guy pretending to be angry video gamer, like that guy that Aaron was making fun of in the Mickey Mouse capades. The the irate gamer or something? No, no, not the irate gamer. It was like some guy, like I forgot what his name was, but he uh. was just like. Like, Aaron was making fun of him, like, Sometimes Minnie will get kidnapped by a bird. <laughs> Just like her. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it's so stupid. Sounds... That guy was, like, such a tryhard, and Aaron and Danny, they made, that was, like, their funniest fucking episode of all fucking time, because I couldn't <laughs> stop laughing. Like, I looked like an idiot at my job, because I was just sitting there for 15 minutes, holding my gut in pain, trying to catch my breath. <laughs> Jesus, this loading is still going? What the f- <laughs> It's such a great game, everybody, it's not noticeable. Like, you know, you even, a bug? even Splatterhouse, which is an un unpolished mess at the worst of times, oh my God, faster like, than this. Fuck. <laughs> the screen, the thing loaded. I just wanted to quit right now. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, the, uh, it's my favorite scene ever. <laughs> I, want it, I want it to be my favorite scene, but then I'm reminded of what Devil May Cry really is about and how much this actually hurts. Hey, get your hands on the ground! We're the extras from Counter-Strike! Aren't the, the extras from Call of Duty? Okay, so, allow me to point out the greatest sin of all fucking time. Like, this is up there with assassinating the Pope and spitting on Jesus' corpse. You gave Virgil a gun. And the next and the next fucking greatest sin is about to be unveiled in this little trade-off. Now you get over there, otherwise we're going to teabag your corpse, like every other Counter-Strike player does. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, I, would, I would love to see these SWAT guys portrayed by Counter-Strike characters, because that would be some hilarious shit. Or, or even Call of Duty players, really. Just, oh little, my just God. little children going, yeah, You suck, oh my bro! God. Get off the, the, the okay, leg! Okay, the dude on the far left, his name is XX420 Blazin. <laughs> the guy in the middle would be Quickscope Jones. Oh and the no. guy on the, like, the far right would be like something like... <laughs> it. Oh, Jesus. And don't worry, I'll censor it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just gonna be three beeps, uh. and nobody's going to know what I said. And they're just gonna be like, what was his name? <laughs> what was his name? What's your name? Oh my god. Uh oh. Hey, get out of here. Ah, trying to play Counter-Strike. cock a, okay. cock -a doodle like, I modern gay fuck stupid. <laughs> oh my god, Virgil's gonna, like, be so lead. He's gonna do a 720 scope. This is so drawn out. This, this is unnecessarily, this is unnecessary tension. This is like a Mexican standoff without all the Mexican in it. 
the real Dante would have this situation covered. I mean, okay, a few buildings would have to collapse uh, before he'd get anything okay, done. Okay, hold but... up. It's time It's time for stupid shit. Oh, yeah, the next uh, big Virgil sin. I love Dante's reaction to this. Fuck. Shit-eating grin. Look, look give him three. S give her. Give her just enough um, enough time to figure out what happened before shooting her in the head. I can't help but feel like Dante would just be like, "What the fuck? You fucking camping bitch!" No, it's a legitimate no, no strategy. Not, not even. Not even the real Virgil would accept that. Like Virgil, yeah, he'll betray you, but he'll betray you to your face, but this like is, he did with Ark. But but you want to know? Uh, but but. It's not just okay. First off, wait, wait, wait. first off, can I just simply say that these SWAT guys can't aim for shit because Cat should have been pumped so full of lead. It's uh, classic movie cliche number four three uh, four twenty six. Okay, this is the only time we've established that Dante can take damage outside of game is that he's sucking in bullets. But even then, it's so fucking stupid because the original Dante, when he took damage, it was utterly hilarious. God. Yeah. Also, by the way, the greatest another. Oh my god! <laughs> ah! <laughs> the scene had to load. <laughs> I didn't catch that. I saw it freeze for a second, and then. That's that's part of the game. That's not my. That's not my PS3. That's part. Oh my god! The fucking Virgil mobile. Is oh, that a oh, okay. Let's let's not forget that. Uh, time stopping powers right the fuck out of nowhere. Yeah, just nowhere. Like this is some like, unlimited. Why? Like this is some unlimited blade works. Why? Bullshit. You're not gonna make it. Again, as I said, this is some unlimited blade works bullshit. Like, how could you do this? How? Uh, and Ninja Theory said that they wanted they wanted this to be a gripping fucking no, to me wanted this to be a gripping narrative that. Uh, oh my God, he's gonna. Blue V! <laughs> He's I... got a blue V on the dash of the Virgil Mobile! Who the fuck does he think he is? V from V from v for de Vendetta? No, you shut up. V is an amazing anti I know, anti I know, which is, why, -hero. Wh which is why I'm saying, does he actually honestly think he is that? He's nowhere near as verbose as v, v is. I know. Or as charming. Even though he tries to act like he's like the leader of Anonymous and 4chan. Naming themselves after a, uh, a, a religious sect that uh, was actually kind of a, a kind of interesting in Devil May Cry Oh my god, 4. it's the boat from Banjo-Kazooie! Oh. oh god! Oh, I hated that stupid boat! Ah, uh, fuck that boat. <laughs> hey, what fuck you guys, I'm done. It's a, I hate that bull. It was from uh, Rusty Bucket Bay. You had to go get the jiggy behind it, oh. and if like the, the the jet propeller started tumbling after you like it was like after the time ran out, no matter how much life you had, it was a one hit kill and you die. And oh jeez. You can't get geez. the jiggy. Oh jeez. <laughs> Rusty Bucket Bay is while it is a great area for a. Oh my god. What the hell happened? I, I fell off a car. Oh, oh, oh. Rusty Bucket Bay, while it is, like, a great area, because, you know, everything about Banjo-Kazooie is great. Everyone can shut their filthy fucking whore mouse if they disagree. Um, Rusty Bucket Bay was just one of those, it's ingeniously designed, but it's unforgivably punishing. Again, I... I'm sorry I'm kind of stuck on this, but why the hell does the time stop at the most convenient moments? Like, Dante's not seen activating time stop in nope. the slightest, otherwise his... And he's otherwise even... His and, and, and what's even worse, even he's kind of perplexed. Like, what the fuck is going on? Uh, because, like, even his palette swap triggers is like, I'm not gonna activate. Also, fuck palette swap trigger. It's this... <sighs> Stupidest thing. They this dropped the ball so hard on that. Dropping the ball worse than the Hunger Games not being about cannibalism. Yeah. 
I'm surprised we didn't get that key the la uh, last time around we played this fucking game. Are you kidding me with this shit? Hold up, one second. It's a great I call. fucking song. Sorry for the excess noise, people. My house is always bl bl blaring classical music. Like, classic rock. You there? It's yeah. It's 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 so bad that even your phone is blaring it. Yeah, it's like I I am such a classical music dork. Okay, so uh, continuing on. So yeah, just fuck any semblance of this area. It makes no goddamn sense. It's like they put. Uh, it's like they just kind of jerry rigged this in here. Oh, I had to uppercut it. No, never mind. Upper cunt is too good of a word because that implies this game has some semblance to Saints Row. Okay, you know what? I think I understand why Tamim said that uh, uh, Dino would move like Spider Man. Did you see how he swung there? Spider Man? Sp fuck you, I like Spider Man. Tamim. I know, but he, t Tamim ruins also, it. Also, by the way, people, that was the mission. Yeah. I hope you enjoy this game, you pieces of shit. <laughs> Oh, well, because I didn't do shit for that one. Yeah, oh, you just kind of skip. This you... is going to make up for it. No shit. <laughs> it's going to so make up for it. Oh, wow, they actually punished me for once. I wouldn't Holy say sh I wouldn't say punished. If that I'm not scene... Gonna su I'm not going to submit my score to the leaderboard because I am not a faggot. Yeah. Fuck if it. I submit my score to the leaderboard, it admits that I do like DMC, and I also watch Donnie Darko, for I too am a faggot. Hey, Donnie Darko's a good, an okay movie. <laughs> Come on. And then the fat Asian chick keeps saying, SHUT UP! Yeah, Shut up! I, I, found that, I, I found that rather odd. It was pointless. It was like, uh, apparently the, the um... The creators, like, the, the director simply said, you know, she was there to symbolize that even when things do go right, some people are still far too broken to, you know, be comforted by the good things that happen in life. To which I still say, SHUT UP! Oh, yeah. <laughs>